office say, every day is for the thief, one day for the owner of the house. But ICPC, the Anti-Corruption Commission, has reversed the rule. It is now every day for the owner of the house. If you're involved in bribery, over-invoicing, or any shady deal, the day of reckoning has come. ICPC, the Anti-Corruption Commission, is watching you. If you're reported for any corrupt practice, you'll be investigated, prosecuted, and punished. Corruption is harmful to our nation. Join the campaign against it by reporting any corrupt practice to ICPC, the Anti-Corruption Commission. Let we join hands with ICPC, make a better Break the chain of corruption now. Don't give, don't take. This message is brought to you by ICPC, the Anti-Corruption Commission. As part of his effort to entrench the culture of transparency and equity in ministries, departments and agencies, the Independent Corrupt Practices and Other Related Offenses Commission, ICPC, has taken a further step by adopting the computer-based test, CBT, for the confirmation and promotion process of its staff. The exercise, which was conducted at the Anti-Corruption Academy of Nigeria, KEFI, Nasara State, was done to promote integrity, raise productivity, and enhance efficiency which constitutes some of the core values of the Commission. Computer-based test is an efficient way to provide a secure, consistent environment for testing of proficiency, competence, and versatility while enhancing the candidate's experience. As the world has advanced from being analog to digital, it has become necessary and more flexible to convert from paper to computer-based processes. Before commencement of the examinations, the chairman of ICPC addressed candidates with words of wisdom and encouragement. Ekbo Nta urged all candidates to embrace the exercise with seriousness as it marks a new era for them and is a reflection of what they stand for, corruption fighters. When it's fully operational, we're looking at conducting exams for clients like JAM, WIED, and the rest that can take 10,000 candidates in a day. And recruitment exercises is, uh, is readily available to take place uh, there. And we are banking on that because this is an integrity organization. So whatever we do that you have seen today already, that it's customized that you don't have any opportunities of uh, doing what you should not do. The head of Public Enlightenment Department, Rashidad Okodua, MNI, who is also the spokesperson of the Commission, and the head of Administration Department, Bako Nathan, spoke on the aim, purpose, and their involvement in the exercise. And so uh, we had jam personnel, technical personnel, helping us with the process. So where there were challenges, uh, all a candidate had to do was to raise his or her hand and then explain the challenge and that would you know, be resolved. So all in all, the process was, it, it went very well and a lot of the staff, or the staff, if not everyone, they are all smiling because you get your results immediately, you finish the exam. So it is very important that um, our people are up to date in terms of ICT capacity and uh, we don't want to take it for granted. So we are using the C computer-based test not only as uh, an integrity system of testing, but also to ginger everybody to get uh, ICT compliance. Mrs. Grace Agaibe, a senior officer in the investigation department, and some of the candidates who partook in the CBT had this to share about their experience. I prefer this because it's just you and your computer and what you know, not who you know. So I recommend that 
other organizations to key into this. It is the best. There is no way for a lobbying to somebody to help you in terms of raising money. It is transparent. As soon as you finish, as soon as you hit the key, it shows you your mark. And that is a mark that ICPC is setting today for the entire country to take. I'll go for CBT anytime, any day. Other events for the day included a tour of the facilities led by the chairman of the commission and other dignitaries. There was also the personal parade of new recruits of the commission.